Hello, friends. Today, we'll learn about solute, solvent, and solution. Very nice. You're studying here. Oh, you have an assignment on this topic. Let's make it easier for you. We'll learn about the solution first. A solution is a specific type of mixture where one substance is dissolved into another. A solution is the same or uniform throughout which makes it a homogeneous mixture. It has some characteristics. A solution is uniform or homogeneous. It doesn't change over time or settle. It does not scatter a beam of light. The particles are so small they cannot be separated by filtering. Common examples of solutions are the sugar in water and salt in soda water, water solutions, etc. Let's prepare a solution. Mix this salt and water. Yeah, this salt water is a solution. You cannot see the salt, and the salt and water will stay a solution if let alone. Hmm, there are two parts of a solution. Solute. It is the substance which is being dissolved by another substance. In this salt water solution, the salt is the solute. Solvent. It is the substance that dissolves the other substance. You're correct. Here, water is the solvent. Now you know that a solution is made when one substance known as the solute dissolves into another substance known as the solvent. Dissolving is when the solute breaks up from a larger crystal of molecules into much smaller groups or individual molecules. In the salt water solution, the water molecules break salt molecules from the bigger crystal lattice. Oh, you want to know about solubility. It is a measurement of how much solute can be dissolved into a liter of solvent. For example, if you keep pouring salt into water, at some point the water isn't going to be able to dissolve the salt. When a solution reaches the point where it cannot dissolve any more solute, it is considered saturated. Let's see what is concentration. The concentration of a solution is the proportion of the solute to solvent. If there is a lot of solute in a solution, then it is concentrated. If there is a low amount of solute, then the solution is said to be diluted. See, this is water and this is ethanol. You can take any amount of ethanol and mix it with any amount of water and you'll always end up with a clear, colorless liquid just like the ones you started with. When two liquids can be mixed to form a solution, they're known as miscible. Can you mix oil and water together? Oil and water are two liquids that are immiscible. They will not mix together. If two liquids cannot be mixed to form a solution, they're known as immiscible. Now you know a lot about solute, solvent, and solution. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.